Four days after torrential downpours caused flooding across central Ohio, residents living at Buckeye Lake are questioning the Ohio Department of Natural Resources and their storm preparations. NBC Force Tyler Carter live at Buckeye Lake. And Tyler, you spoke with ODNR, and what did they tell you? And you know, this is the spillway here at Buckeye Lake. As you can see, water is still rushing out. Residents say they don't believe ODNR opened the spillway soon enough, but ODNR tells me tonight they spent two days draining the lake in preparation of last Thursday's storm. Thursday's downpour left parts of Buckeye Lake completely underwater. Over the weekend, residents spent time cleaning up and salvaging what they could. Some residents on the lake are questioning how ODNR prepared for the storm. Neighbors were screaming, yeah. the place was flooding out, and, yep. and water was clear up to my knees. George Bow and his girlfriend Kathy Burnsworth's apartment is uninhabitable following the storm. It's sickening. They should at least get a better draining system. In a statement, ODNR says there is nothing they could have done for what Mother Nature caused. ODNR opened the lake drains at Buckeye Lake two days in advance of the storm to create more storage capacity within the lake. Even within the advanced preparation, the water levels in the lake reached more than two feet above the targeted interim levels that are currently being maintained. This was the problem over here. George Abdallah has lived on the lake for more than 70 years. He says ODNR shouldn't be blamed for the flooding. It wasn't just the lake that overflowed, but heavy rain caused the drains on the side of the roads to clog, adding to the flooding. I feel that they opened and did the correct amount of planning. It was, again, just the hard pounding of the water. The area around the lake had about five inches of rainfall. Spokesperson for ODNR tells me tonight that the water flowing over the spillway is by design. It's to protect the lake and to protect the residents area from overflowing. But they tell me what happened on Thursday was an act from Mother Nature. Reporting live out here at Buckeye Lake, I'm Tyler Carter for NBC4.